walk up to Jackie. He's calm and collective as usual. And uh, he's confident. I said, uh, Jackie, uh, we're getting ready to shoot, it, it looks like. Uh, but we don't know, you know, our choreography. What, what's going on? And he just kind of smiled. He goes, no problem. He says, back up a little bit. He says, show me some techniques. And uh, so I backed up and I did some kicks, some round kicks and side kicks and front kicks. You know, your basic kicks. Then I did some jump spinning kicks. And he was smiling at the time and nodding his head. And then I noticed he was playing his hands. He was just doing the drums, playing the drums on his legs. So I stopped and I said, Jackie, what are you doing? He said, Keith, he says, I'm working out the beat, the musical rhythm of the fight sequence. I said, what are you talking about? He goes, all fight scenes should have a beat to it, should have a rhythm to it. He says, let me tell you why. He says, let's take the two most technical, the best, most famous fighters on the planet and put him in a fight scene. If there's no beat, if there's no rhythm, he says, your subconscious won't like what you're seeing. He says, now think about it. You still got the two best fighters of all time there. Uh, their techniques are incredible, but your subconscious is going, that's ah, something's wrong here. He says, why? Because there's no beat. He says, all fight sequences should have a rhythm, should have a beat. Then he started working out the beat for our next film. Right there. It's not choreographed an hour before or a month before. Right there, he thinks about what the fight sequences will be, worked it out, and then he says, here's what I want you to do. We rehearse. We were ready to shoot. Why don't you go ahead and show the clip? Awesome. Me. <laughs> I love being the bad guy. This is so good. <laughs> <laughs> Two, three. One, two, three. Boom, boom. Wow. And pause it there. Go ahead. And, and Dutch, pause it there. Did you see that hand motion uh -huh. and that how they did that? They took longer yeah, did. to shoot that sequence, not the fight before it, not my fight with Benny coming up, but that hand motion sequence when they look at each other, it's all choreographed perfectly. They spent almost 30 minutes on that. Not 30 minutes on a fight sequence, but 30 minutes on that. So that really goes to, sh to show how much of a perfectionist they are putting these fight sequences together. Go ahead. I, it, you know, it's incredible. That, that harkens back to the theatrical roots. Uh, you know, the, the, the take, do it takes multiple times just to get it right. And honestly, I don't think they do it to get it right. I think they do it to not get it wrong. So uh, again, uh, martial arts theater, that whole theatrical background, it really has lent a lot to their films and them being able to keep up with the rhythm of that is just something else. So but yeah, uh let's let's make sure we get this guy in. And then the bad guys show up. Oh I love it. I'm gonna see these guys before. If you've ever seen trouble before, it's always in a blazer. <laughs> Watch the movements. Uh, they're tough. They're super tough. We better run. Mm. Huh? Come on. And what they're saying there is, they're too tough. Let's run. And Benny and I love <laughs> that. We just love the fact they were saying that. Now, of course, it's just movies. And uh, it's, but just the fact that having the great Jack, Jackie Chan and Yong Bao look at us and go, they're too tough. Let's run. And then run away from us. It's like, it, it doesn't get any cooler than that. It's, it's all movies, but it's still cool. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. And, you know, I took so, that um, lesson of choreography, of uh, creating a fight sequence that has beat rhythm. And I used that same method when I choreographed uh, my own fight uh, sequences for American Kickboxer. Uh, we shot a film in, in South Africa with uh, John Barrett, the star of that film. I not only starred in it, but I was also the choreographer of the film. And it was so nice to draw my inspiration back to Jackie Chan on what he had taught me about beat and rhythm. One, two, three, boom. One, two, three, boom. And, and it worked out. That's some turn turned out well as, as well. Listen, I'm so glad you got a chance to, to watch this with me. 
And I hope everybody watching uh, enjoyed the episodes. And if you did, please like, share with a friend, and uh, be sure to subscribe. And then watch out other episodes. You're going to see me talking about the great Ben Yukitas and Samuel Hung and Yong Bao and all these others and other behind the scenes Wills on Mills episodes as well. So check those out. And until then, I'm Keith Vitale. Ciao.